Let's go. All right. So to start this one off, this is back to prized format. Prize just got a few new cards, four new cards from spell, you know, signature spellbook Jace. Brainstorm, Jace Bolera, Negate, and one other. I don't remember off the top of my head what that other one was. Two pair. Yeah, so two pair. High five, or high six. I'm seeing, however, four of a four kind. Of a kind. <laughs> what do you say? I'll be able to play. Yeah, that'll do it. So these are both going to be decks testing out. Now, Brainstorm is really good, and it fills out the cantrip spot. You know, right now the format prior to this did not have any one-drop cantrips. But you only get one Brainstorm because it is restricted in vintage. So it's not, I'm assuming, going to break the format anytime soon. It might. We'll see. I will keep. Me too. All right, you're up. Hey. Go ahead. All right. I'm obviously holding something up. Well, we'll try it. Soul Ring. Pass turn. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Sight. All right. Down there. <laughs> Hi, Delver. Go ahead. That'll resolve. All right. Well. We're going to try to resolve a Thran Dynamo. That's my big one. Makes three mana. Colorless mana. Sure. Okay. Go for it. Pass turn. <laughs> I'm going to keep my mana rocks down here with the lands. We'll flip it over. Oh no. We got a, we got a lightning bolt. <laughs> uh oh. As Evangeline would say, that can't be good. Yeah. Smack you for three. Alright, 17. Go ahead. Play an island. Mm -hmm. Alright, I will... Pass the turn. Hmm. Yeah, I scooched the insect operation down just to be seen a little bit more visibly. I have beginning of combat. I would like to try anyway. We're going to float one. I would like to. Uh, Bounce your insectile aberration and draw a card. Uh. Okay. Yes. Blip, blip, blip. <laughs> we know where that's going. Go ahead. All right. I would like to cast Gilded Lotus. This one makes three mana of any color I choose. Okay. I would like to cast an Impulse. Look at the top four, put one in my hand, put the others on the bottom in any order. Mm, sure. Actually, let me check to make sure, because this one is weirdly worded. It says put them on the bottom and then shuffle them. I know I should know which one is correct, but obviously those two don't work well with one another, so uh, yeah, just put them back on the bottom in any order. No shuffle. So, here we go. Conrad. It says shuffle them. Yeah, it says that. Oh, shuffle your library after. You can see why okay. put them on the bottom, shuffle afterwards might not. Yeah, make a lot of sense. Conrad, would you, would you move please, buddy? Please? Sorry, dude. <laughs> All right, but I like all of these, every last one. Alas, I will choose you, I believe. I think that's the correct answer. It is. Okay. 
Then we'll put the bottom in any order. Put them on the bottom in any order. Why not that order? This will totally come up again. And then I will pass the turn. Alright, what you got? Go to combat. Alright. Hit me. Go ahead. End of turn. Fact or fiction. What's that do then? EOT FOFYL. End of turn. Fact or fiction. You lose. Although, in this format, maybe. Uh, spell Pierce. Yep. Results. It gives me basically. If there's a card I want in the top five, I get it. Cool. And maybe a little bit of bonus, too. So I'll draw. Ooh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. 8, 11. That is how that works. Okay. Float 11. Uh, you know where this is going. Upheaval. Return all permanents to their owner's hands. If you have a force of will, now's the time. Sure. Okay. So there's 11 mana floating, 6 of which is blue. Spend one of the colorless, so 4 remaining soul ring. Spend that, the 4 colorless left on 3 and dynamo. Tap these two for Gilded Lotus, play an island, and then price check. I have five cards in hand, I'll pass the turn. Yep. Counter draw. Days! Woo! Okay. Okay. I did indeed make Days live again. Alright, that's your turn? Yep. Alright. Pass turn. <laughs> hey, it works. Go it ahead. works. Alright, no attacks? Oh, yeah. yeah. One. Why not? It's a fugitive wizard. Why not? Alright. Mana Vault? Yep. Pass turn. Hey, there we go. Back to being an insectal aberration. Okay. Yeah, that can tutor up all sorts of things. Oh, fun. I think I'm mad because a deck with this much mana got got by days. <laughs> <laughs> Got, got, well, by days. Spell Pierce and days. Yeah, <laughs> fair enough. Mm. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, swing for three. Hit me down to seven. Go ahead. All right. Brainstorm. Draw three. Two back. <clears throat> Excuse me. Good.
not play the land yet. 1, 2, 5, 7, 10, 13. Float two. Okay. Doesn't let everything bounce. All right. So I need to do this correctly. I spent one, two, five, and then a color. Or excuse me, I spent one, two, and then the rest can all be colorless. So in doing so, let's see. Again, we made two, five, seven, ten, thirteen minus six. We have seven left. And of that seven, three is blue. Which makes me wonder if I miscounted my mana earlier. And hope to goodness I did not. Okay. So play a land. Alright. Spend a colorless on Soul Ring. Spend a colorless on Mana Vault. It means there's three left. Uh, now there's five. Make it one. Are we still good? Stop mm -hmm. me if you need to. Um, add three. And one. Gilded Lotus. Mm -hmm. You may add three. Sensei's Divining Top. Yeah. Then hmm. And then I'll Before pass the turn. Before we change phase. Okay. Um in that case. Float three, hard cast force of will. There was already two left, since we haven't changed phase yet. Okay. Okay, but now I gotta remember you, so we'll put a reminder die up. I am so worried that I messed up my mana earlier. Um, pass turn. Yep, it makes it this time. Okay. So I'm going to spend five on my upkeep to untap the mana vault, uh, four on untapping it, and one on Sensei's Divining Top. Mm -hmm. So, there we go. Oh, wow. Okay. Yep, that's going to be my draw. Of course. In that case, one... Factor Fiction. Days. Oh, okay. That's a that's a days. I'll float three and you know spend one of it so two's left. All right, my friend. Here are your choices. One, two, three, four, five. You can divide those however you so choose. And the others go in my grave, so they actually go in first. Final answer? Ooh. Hmm. Very interesting. I think I'll take these. Counterspell and Thran Dynamo. Uh, cool. Play a land. Spend another, since I still have some floating mana off of Gilded Lotus, I'll spend another one still floating, and we'll spin the top again. Hello, nurse. Uh, spin the. Nope, we're good. Pass turn.
Oh my god, not again. Alright, that's Impulse. That's your uh, look at the top four, add one to your hand card. You're getting way too close for comfort here. Way too close for comfort. Oh, you didn't take some. No, I did not. It's in the yard. Rip and pepperoni. Rip and paparazzi. Got me down to four. Go ahead. All right. I'm gonna do this again so that the mana vault doesn't deal me damage. Draw. Gee, I wonder what I'm gonna get. It's a torrential gear hulk. Rar. Mm -hmm. Though I can probably do that a little bit better. You know what? I already said. I already said I cast it, so we'll we'll cast it. Uh, torrential gear hulk is going to get back. Cryptic command. The modes are bounce, and then I'll draw. Sure. All right. And then I will pass the turn. End of your turn, swords. Hmm. Counterspell. Sure. Alright, there you go. go. Yep. Swords. Spin the top. Mm -hmm. Force a little sure. pitch mystical to here. Go ahead. All right. Do this bit again. Mana. Crash in. Jump. Okay. I will make six. Pay four. Go to two. Three and dynamo. Make three. Uh, go to five. Spend four. Three and dynamo. One left. Sensei's divining top. And. I will pass the turn. No cards at hand. Help. Mm -hmm. I'm do this as my reminder. This, this was, uh, upheaval was a thing in standard back in the day. Just a lot. Go ahead. It was real fun. Uh, spin the top. Cool. Okay. We'll do this. Alright, um, we'll tap these to pay for the mana vault to untap, but everything else gets to do its thing. Combat? Ooh, okay.
Yeah. Okay. So. Five. Yep. Five. Um. Let's see. Spend five. Drop another gilded lotus, and then pass the turn. End of turn. Uh oh. Even mind sensor. Um, I'm going to spin the top. It resolves. Good enough. Yep. Okay. So we have our chump blocker. Um, yeah, you do get to see. That's right. That's right. That's how that works. Alright. It's manifest. You gotta see yeah. if it's a creature. Um. Yeah, it took, I, it took me a split second to remember that. Wait a minute. In for two. Alright, you have me at two. Can he do it? Go ahead. Can he do it? Alright. Spin the top. You got me. You got me. All he has to do is jump. Woo! That was close, man. That was so close. Game two. Right, here we go. Game two. Oop. There we are. Something like that. We have a straggler at the bottom of the deck. Alright, so I would like to go first. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Um... Ooh. I think I have to keep it, actually. Yeah, we'll, we'll keep. This is fine. I'm reminded of the comic. This is fine. I'll keep. Alright. Whale. Let's go Island, Mana Crypt. <laughs> uh, but we're gonna impulse. Sure. Alright, let's see what I get. Two, three, four. I like all of these, but I have to go with you. I'm obligated. And then I'll pass the turn. And doing it then so that I don't have to worry about his counter spells. Okay. Oh, well, hi Delver. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> it may not be much of a difference, but having even just a single brainstorm helps Delver a lot. Obviously it lets you transform Delver a bit, but gets you through the early game, draws you into force of will, and so on. Alright. Blip, blip. Do you remember there was that format people talked about for a while called Eternal, which was Legacy but without the reserve list cards? Well, long story short, this is something you would actually see. Instead of the dual lands, you had the shock lands. And you can imagine it made somewhat of a difference. The card pool on this is greatly different than Legacy, but... Hey! Go ahead. Yeah, we're, we're good with that. Well, actually, I'm not, but what choice do I have? Oh, oh, oh! Odds, I take three damage. Evens, I'm fine. Even, it's a six all the way off the table. Okay. So there we go, and I'm going to keep my handy dandy reminder die. That is the upkeep after all. Okay. So, let's play around that daze by going two mana. Let's see. Ooh, that actually does not help me that much. <coughs> Are you alright, man? Yeah. Alright. So two mana. One mana, Soul Ring. Mm -hmm. Three mana, four, Thran Dynamo. Sure. And then I will pass the turn. 
All right. Oh no! <laughs> and it's a swords too. It's a so it's a swords to plowshares. It's a swords. Just ugh, hurts to hear myself say that. Okay, strip mine. That's a card. We vintage now. Vintage with Thrain Dynamo. Mm -hmm. mm. Alright, take the three. Good. Alright. So obvious sword is obvious. Okay, safe. If I can just keep that up, we might be in okay shape. Maybe. Alright. Gilded Lotus. All of the mana. Let's see. Almost. Past turn. In the turn. Oh, high containment priest. Um, hmm. that is a tricky one. Um, because I know what's in your hand, or at least I know one card in your hand. Obvious sword is obvious. I think I'm supposed to be patient here. Okay, it resolves. Good combat. All right. Scoop for five. Torrential. Uh, yeah. Obviously trigger. Ooh. Ooh. That's spicy. All right. Ouch. Okay. Oh, untap all of this. Oh my god, and I've gotten six three times as well. I'm not just an even, specifically six. Wait a minute. I'm not sure how I feel like yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> Island, pass turn. Tell me, Mr. Anderson, what is mana if you can't spend it? What good is mana if you can't spend it? Go to combat? Yep. Alright. Go ahead. If I miss this time, I will be quite into lethal. Okay. Finalement. Eventually it's going to happen. But you know what? We're going to be dumb. We're going to tap everything. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, before you do something. Uh, Fourteen minus... Okay, so I'm going to have eight floating after this. And of that... How much is colorless? Uh, six? Yeah, six is colorless. Yeah. Results? Alright, cool. Float. Okay. Yeah, blue and color. Alright. Whee! Alright, so I have six blue and two colorless. This is in my hand. Yay. Now, I may actually not want to play the Mana Crypt again. <laughs> that, that may end up...
killing me here, so maybe let's not. I'm going to go to one colorless soul ring. Uh, three colorless, spin one of the blue for Thran Dynamo, five blue in the pool. Make four, or make three, so five and three. Go to three blue in the pool, Gilded Lotus. And then... Mmm, Jay, you, you can't risk it. You actually can't. You will just lose. And then we pass the turn. Okay. Yep. Yep. I need to get some seriously good top decks, though, to get me out of this. Oh, hi, VP. Uh -huh. That is not a seriously good top deck. Gilded Lotus. Mm -hmm. Pass turn. Alright, don't transform. STOP TRANSFORMING! <laughs> okay. Well, yeah, that's a thing, I guess. That is a thing. Was that I said about needing some seriously good top decks? Any time now. All right. Nope. So the alternate play there was play out the Mana Crypt so that I could force of will the Delver on the way down, but then I have to deal with Mana Crypt for who knows how many turns. Which... Yeah, I'm just gonna say I die the first time. <laughs> that's probably what... Even with my luck, that's probably what ends up happening. So... Yeah. It's unfortunate. Oh well. Oh well. That's that. I wonder if there's a way I could have played my mana rock such that I could have kept enough mana for Force of Will throughout. Probably was. Soul Ring, Gilded Lotus, and just leave it at that. Island, Soul Ring, Gilded Lotus. That was probably the better way to do it rather than running out the Thran Dynamo. Looking back at it, oh well. Live and learn. Ta da!